what is up everyone god damn we're back firewatch part two but all the way down here because this is the fourth time i'm doing this hopefully it works this time because my game keeps doing this like weird little day thing and it keeps on to delete it and i don't know why it's really annoying except the line i ring running the radio does and she wants to go look at power line them whatever the whatnot Okay, drop down here. Oh, yeah, I can only jump over here. Leap. Oh, he's, he's already dead. But he's dead already. It's only been a minute. This game's great, Tara. It's beautiful. Firewatch. I'm stuck. No, I'm not. Yeah. Okay, there we go. It's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder though, right? Yeah, they are. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what's life like? Wow. Uh, you know, uh, I don't know. I used to just spend a lot of time with our dog, Bucket. Aw, that's a good name. He was a good dog. What type? A beagle. We got him from the pound. That's great. Hey, can you hold on a sec? Uh, sure. Just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms up. Hey, yo. I don't think so. Why, have you? Okay, good. Do you listen to this conversation? has any idea. I'm absolutely sure. Would you? All right. I'll let you know if anything changes. Sorry about that. Anyway, Bucket's a cute name. You, um, you owned him with someone? <sighs> I'm gonna see it for a second. Oh, like, like your wife? Or like she's taken half my stuff, wife? My wife. But you're here. She's sick. And I shouldn't be here, but I am. I'm, I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Now I need to go up here. Please, for the love of God, I hope this works. Don't break my game, please. Oh? Hold up. Oh, it works. Oh my God. Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. Well, follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. I won't go this way. Connect through there. What's this? Where am I actually? Hold on. Oh, I'm all over there. Wow. What's this? Uh, hey, I found a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh, you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, but, you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. I mean, uh, I'm in the right area? I do believe. Uh, the comms wire runs for quite a ways. Follow it all the way to the top of Beartooth Point, and if it's not damaged, you can loop around back home. This outhouse is in the middle of nowhere. Well, I hate to tell you, but everything out here is in the middle of nowhere. You know what I mean. Am I on the right track? Just keep following the wire to the top of the ridge, and then you can head back. Anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello? Okay then. 
I'm going in the cabin. Gang, we're going in. Oh wow. Look at this house. I bet. Alright. Oh, that might good. I think it's hot stuff. Anything else in here? Wait, where was that guitar? Hold on. I need to test something. When you drop stuff, it's like you huck it. Can I? That guitar's gone now. I'm never getting that guitar ever again. Oh, let's get back to them. Keep following the wires. Well, the wires go this way, so that means I won't go this way. How many wires are there, blah? There's a lot of wires. Oh, I like this thing. You can't just. Oh, that's another cash box. I see. I want to go get that. Looks like it's broken up there. But I want to get this. Gosh, I don't think I can get that cash box. Hold on. I'd like to get it though. I'll see if I can get it. Mm, didn't look like it. Little body like a barrier. Yep. <coughs> Unless I can go this way. Don't think I can. Oh, hello. Uh, yeah. Okay, the wires down here. Really? Awesome. Good find. It's like I don't know, a mile and a half east of me. You just follow the trail up the hill. You can't miss it. I'll go see what the damage is. Well, I want to open this first, and the code is one, two, three, four. What does it say? Dave, hey yo, I got your nerve about needing to talk. I'm sorry I didn't track you down. Been looking for you all day. Figured you'd be out near the canyon helping those grad students, but I guess not. I don't even know how I could really help anyway. We're, we are co-workers, you know. Amigos, professionals. What's this guy yapping gapping all about, bro? If you need someone to throw a case back with, a, with and go time travelling... One's your guy, but I'm not great with the with the live stuff. You know, like yeah. Oh, that is very nice. Keep that, and then we got pine cones and all that. Very nice. Is there a plank? A board, haha. Uh -huh. Oh, a book. Hello. Six feet down under. Yeah, so I can just go there. I guess they don't want me to investigate up close, so we gotta go back down, go up and around. I think that's what we want to do at least. Well, we're gonna find out. Amazing, this game is bloody amazing. People call it a walking simulator. Well, I like it, even if it's one. I'm a big fan. So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires. What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just seems dangerous. Well, if they don't hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out. But I'd rather it not come to that. All right, I'm up here. Hey, 
so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was too tight, deliberately. It's snipped clean through, and there's a bunch of beer cans out here. The same beer those girls were drinking, and they also left us a, a message. <sighs> These idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. But that's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here Damn! What the hell was that? make a spooky ghost costume but they stole my sheets mm, i don't know um wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy <laughs> i'll find them thanks but i am gonna need a raise <sighs> don't hold your breath i'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them well they're big into red eagle <laughs> great See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Well, I hopped down a drop and now I can't climb back up. Mm, that is a pickle. I can just keep hiking, but I figured I should let you know in case I get myself trapped out here. Hopefully that doesn't happen before you find these assholes. I was thinking you should probably head back to where you saw them last. Can I go this way? Oh, I can. There's nothing. Okay. Nice of me. So I'm over here. Come back and go up here this way. Okay, there's a lot of beer around there. Oh, I uh, didn't mention that they made the hillside up here their own personal dumpster. <sighs> I am serious, Henry. I want these girls to never, ever want to go backpacking ever again. I hear you. Ooh, wee. Wee. <laughs> well, there's a big hand everywhere, man. What's wrong with these girls? What's this place? Is that just like... I don't want to go for it real quick. Oh, I've got an overgrown trail here. Yeah, that'll happen. So I'm screwed when it comes to getting past it? Mm-hmm. Screwed until you clear it yourself, yeah. Great. Well, if I come across some tools, I'll add groundskeeping to my ever-increasing list of responsibilities. Very nice. Guess I'll go at the Jersey Lake. Two miles, two point one, four point eight. I could go that way. Well, let's go this way just for a bit, explore, shall we? Correct. Hello. This all five. One, two, three, four. Is 
Yes. That was useless. Well, let's go back this way then. Let's go. Oh, I don't want to fold it. Can I just... Oh, I thought I saw someone. Is this it? What the hell? Hey. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always go for it for supplies. Yes, I will. Prime Goodwin's backpack. Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them, in decent condition too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up. I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left. Yeah, he only used three or four. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. He was a lookout? <laughs> yeah, kinda, I guess. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? Mm, no. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. What, they couldn't uh, handle your unique brand of charm? Not many can. Unsurprising. Anyway, so it goes. Have uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a photodome employee. I don't know, I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Well, supply cash around there. <laughs> Three, four. I'll copy that information. Thank you very much. Anything here? A stone, a fossilized claw. What the hell? Someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Could be the same person who left that antler. Maybe they're leaving me an entire creature piece by piece. Yeah, I'm gonna throw that back in there. What does this note say? <clears throat> hey, who are these guys, Ron and Dave? They're leaving notes for each other in the boxes. Is there any chance one of them was that guy I saw in the canyon? You know, the guy with the flashlight? No, they're both rangers. They're not out here this season. Um, guess is going out with Debbie next week. No, 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 not that. Yeah, Steve, it's your man Ron. I went up to check out the new guy at Two Forks and heard him talking to himself more than usual for a lot of hellos. So I figured I'd stay away. Remember when you saw Chimney Rock having himself in that hammock? I'm starting to think the Forest Service only picks the deranged and perverted. Except for us, of course, with a cream de lim cream. Creme de la creme? I don't know. Let's toast to the bad spot. Ron. I assume the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting looted. It's somehow comforting to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid. I see a really thin plume of smoke. Yeah, I see it too. A thin plume like this is either a new fire or a campfire. Campfire? Y you think it's them? So. It looks like it's to the southwest of me. That's right. If you hike towards Five Mile Creek, that should put you in the neighborhood. Keep an eye on that smoke plume. Let me know if it's getting any larger. Uh, I will know what's around here. Yeah. 
Alright, let's keep going. Ooh, I'm having a hell of a time getting this fucking flapjack off his ass and out to repair that wire. Excuse me, flapjack? You know, like a loser, a chotch. I really don't, but I do now. Well, the next time you're at a bar and some banker steps on your foot so he can order his crappy martini, you've got just the name to use. Hey. Flapjack, why don't you wait your turn before I bounce your face off a dumpster? It's beautiful. Alhamdulillah. What does she have? She's got Alzheimer's, like um, dementia. Is she? Is she? She's alive. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you guys found out? We were scared shitless. We went straight to the doctor after her first spell or whatever. They diagnosed her and we were both just very scared. Can't really tell when... Julia is scared. She just gets quiet. She was very quiet. This scenery in this game absolutely beautiful. Honestly, unbelievable. Thunder Canyon. I'm not seeing that smoke anymore. Oh, it's still burning away. Try heading west from where you are. If you loop past the lake, there should be a trail that'll take you further south. Thanks. That helps. Well, let's keep going then. Is it my tower there? Yeah. That's my tower. Oh, oh, there we go. Who do they think they are? I'm, I'm watching my fires in there. They're burning campfires. Unbelievable. What is this music? I'm scared. I didn't need to go up there, but you know, I just felt like it apparently. Oh, this music. Dun, 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 God, I don't know who these girls think they are. Terrorize them. It's an amazing, beautiful place. I will stop them. I will. So, how'd you meet? Met in a bar. Mm, the birthplace of modern romance. I walked over and asked her what her major was because I thought she was a student, not a prof. Smooth. That's me. I did make the first move, though. Oh, you were brave. I was drunk. Keep going this way then. Nope. 
Så kan jag inte ha kram och så kan jag... Vad är det där? Jag vill inte smaka. Jag Jag vet bara fan det var lockbox. Jag har inte så mycket sådär. Det är inte bra idag. One, two, three, four. Get this information down. I'm sure it's a missing person. How many hikers go missing in the Shoshone? More than none, unfortunately, with most of them being in this area. The thoroughfare because it's so remote. Why? I found an old flyer for a missing hiker. It just got me thinking, that's all. Like how you said one day you were talking to the Goodwins and then the next you weren't. Ned Goodwin didn't get mauled by a bear or stuck in a ravine. He was just a PTSD a-hole who dragged his son out to do a job and realized it was a bad idea. Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's, uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. PTSD. That doesn't sound good. Yeah, I don't know. He was in the army. She was... off. It's actually the saddest story. He was only discharged because his mother, Brian's grandmother, died. She'd been taking care of him, and Ned was the only next of kin. Damn. And you got to know Brian a little bit? Yeah. I talked to him way more than I talked to Ned, that's for sure. How was he at, uh, you know, spotting fires? <laughs> Better than you. He actually liked to stay in the tower. I don't have a damn choice. What's the fire of that? I come on, tape. Oh, where the hell am I going? I'm not fucking sure. I actually have no idea where I'm going. It's a really nice waterfall down here. Given those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Maybe it was a bear. <laughs> Oh. I see a campsite and it looks like they've got a fire. Is it them? That seems like it. I swear, they must have dragged four cases of beer out here. Track them down and don't let them see you. What a job this is. I have entered the teen zone. Oh, really? And where's that? It's the name of a magazine for girls. It's on the ground here at their camp. Huh. Pants are back. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, pants are back? Well, according to the experts at Teen Zone magazine, it's unclear where they've been. The pants, I mean? Well, I found some dangerous hunks. What on earth are you? It's another one of those magazines. I don't get why the hunks have to be so dangerous. Well, you're clearly not a young woman. Girls should want nice hunks. Ugh, boring. These girls have a full case of beer left here. A full case. Well, they're impressive little shits, I guess. That is some dedication. How much beer did they bring up, Bob? Ah, found my sheets. So they did break into your tower. Looks like. Your tent looks like it's been through the shredder. Which would explain that scrap I found. What could have done that? Like a like a bear or um I don't know, it sounds crazy, but even a bull elk if it's off its rocker. Whatever did it did not hold back. You've got that camera, right? You know, maybe I should take one of their sleeping bags as payback. At this stage, take whatever you want. Oh, they're gone for sure. How can you tell? Well, the girls left someone. Me, I guess, a note. Well, what's it say? They're threatening to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well, 
Did you? I didn't do anything to them. But it looks like someone had it out for them. Then why do they think it's you? Fuck, I don't know. Huh. Hey, I don't. I believe you. Come on, Henry. All right. All right, it's just it's weird what happened out here. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers. They could be having a bad mushroom trip. We really don't know. But they're gone. There's no way to call the cops. They're not coming back. And we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Yeah, me too. Why are you asking? Because I'm horribly superficial. I could be Tom Cruise's good-looking twin brother. Oh, that's too bad. I wrote in people he's like five foot nothing. Yeah, well, you can't win them all. Okay, well, that gives me a good start. Now let's see. In my scope, I can only tell you're a white guy wearing shorts. It's hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. It's not very, uh, you know, PC, or whatever they say. Oh my god, you are the whitest man. Wow. <laughs> I don't need a spotting scope for that. And if not shorts, then what do you normally like to wear? Uh, I don't know. I like to look nice, usually. Well, I try now, I guess. Hmm, had a bit of a schlubby period, did we? Yeah, a good 25, 30 years, yeah. But, um... Now you'll put on a, a clean shirt? Yeah. Well, I, I have one that I got for Christmas, actually. Just, um, it's navy with white buttons, but I, I like it. I don't wear it that much, so. Well, it sounds just perfect. Now tell me about your face. I'm looking at you across the bar. What do I see? Uh... <laughs> hmm. Well, a pretty thick beard. Oh. Have you always had a beard? For a while, yeah. All right, perfect. I want to know about your eyes. Get out of here. I'm drawing you. I need to know. Your what? Is, is that okay? Uh... Don't, <laughs> don't answer. I'm going to do it regardless. Fine. Your eyes, tell me. I had them a CD if I'm going to go steely, cold hard stare. Mm, like a Siberian husky. <laughs> uh, sure. Okay, got it. Thank you, Henry. You get what you need? Absolutely. That was weird. And as I said, when it ended up to her, very nice. Great game. I'm, I'm loving it so far. The series is absolutely beautiful. I'm not going to get some boards. See you later in the next one.